The Minnesota Fine Vikings had a pretty damn dynamite 2021 NFL draft class, and it's easy to get hyped about Christian Derrissaw, Wyatt Davis, no matter what, and Kellen Mond and Sage Surratt. But what about the day three guys, huh? Besides Jalen Twyman and Smith Marset and the tight end who can punt, man. A lot to be hyped about. But under the radar is rookie fourth-round pick Janarius Robinson out of the Florida State University. And our guy Jordan Reed over at the Draft Network wrote about his five favorite day three picks. Robinson made the list. Here's what he wrote. Quote, many thought that the Vikings would risk taking an edge rusher in the first round as they were linked to Quiddy Pay as well as Jalen Phillips. But they don't know. They don't. They never know about Spielman. With both still on board with the 14th pick, they elected to trade back and stay true to their belief of drafting players at that position on day two. Damn straight. The streak of the team not drafting edge rusher in the opening two rounds since 2005 remains intact, but the trend of selecting athletic prospects with room to grow at the position held true. Robinson fits the exact mold that the team covets as he's a lengthy athlete that still needs to be coached on the finer points of the position. There hasn't been a better coach in the league at developing defensive line talent than defense coroner Andre Pat. Patterson. His next pupil in a long lineage is the former Florida State product. And Robinson flew under the radar because uh, he was always solid and, and improving, but he never banged it out. He never paid off and that four-star recruit uh, potential. And he didn't have eye-popping stats like some of the other premium edge rushers. Peak PF at pass rushing grade was 72.7 in 2020. Only had 20.5 career tackles for loss, 8 sacks, a 9.1% pressure rate. But his pro day showed off that physical potential, man. Long arms, fast, 4.7240, big-time hands as well. Explosive, 25 reps on the bench, uh, 9.39 out of 10 on the relative athletic score and I think this is a perfect spot for him as well as third round pick Patrick Jones coming out of pit they can rotate in play 10 to 15 snaps a game as rookies and getting tutelage from Andre Patterson getting some mentorship by Daniil the real deal hunter the best edge rusher in the game coming back from the hernia disc in his neck where he rushed from both sides of the ball at Florida State and played about half of his snaps as a stand-up outside linebacker so he loved that versatility and I think that Robinson certainly could be a much better pro than his college production would suggest I think that he's a guy on the upward trajectory especially since there isn't pressure for him to be the man right away whereas if if he was drafted much earlier there would be that and the Vikings have done this process before like Jordan alluded to the national media jabroni haircuts always try to mock edge rusher to the Vikings in the first round. Ah, uh, Quiddy Pay, Ah, uh, Russo, oh, or a Phillips this year, or Yedagros Matos or AJ Epinesa last year. But in 15 drafts, Rick Spielman has never spent a first or second round pick on edge. There is a method to the madness. There are some misses for sure. I, I mean, look at this. I mean, uh, it's funny that Scott Crichton is the highest pick of all these guys, but there's some huge hits. Trust the system. Brian Robinson developed and replaced Ray Ray Edwards. Everson developed and replaced Jared Allen. Daniil developed and replaced B-Rob. DJ Wanham. Jones a second. Janarius will have a chance to develop and start opposite of Daniel Hunter. Pay Daniel, by the way. Love this platoon of pass rushers. And Janarius might be a sleeper as a rookie, where he might get limited snaps, but could get work on passing downs on edge, stand-up, or maybe even inside, and get some puck luck going his way, get a handful of sacks, and make an impact right away. So I'm very bullish on Janarius Robinson, the pride of Tallahassee. And in fact, this entire defensive line is just sublime. And now free James Lynch. So why not? And Twyman. It's so deep. It's so competitive. It's so young. I love it, man. I love it. Uh, be your thoughts. Janus Robinson, day three sleeper. Let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support that work? Pull some of the Venmo. But until next time, Skull, production value.